Sleeping is our usual routine and a huge need for our bodies, but we don't often think about this phenomena. Hello everyone, I'm Muna Zaru and today I'll talk about sleep. First, let's define sleep. Sleep is a natural recurring state of mind and body characterized by inhibition of nearly all voluntary muscles and reduced interaction with surroundings. Physiologists divide sleep into two different behavioral states. Non rapid eye movement occur first after a period named deep sleep or slow wave sleep. During the non rapid eye movement, the body temperature and heart rate fall and the brain uses less energy. Then the rapid eye movement. It is a smaller part of all sleep time and it is when you can have dreams or nights. Natural sleep cycle alternatively between non rapid eye movement and rapid eye movement takes an average of 90 minutes occurring 4 to 6 times. We all know that sleep is a native need, so why lack of it is bad for your health? Well, sleep boosts your mental well being, so lack of it leads to fatigue, uh, lack of focus, uh, short of temper, and bad mood. Moreover, prolonged lack of sleep can disturb your immune system and can lead to serious medical issues. Studies have shown that people who don't have enough sleep up to 7 hours a day tend to gain more and more weight than normal sleepers. Well, lack of sleep reduces levels of leptin, the chemical that makes you feel full, and increases levels of ghrelin, the hunger stimulating hormone. Plus, sleeping less over time leads to heart diseases, uh, high blood pressure, diabetes, so it's ruining your life. Lack of sleep can lead to serious medical issues, but what happens when you oversleep? Experts at the National Sleep Foundation say that having 7 to 9 hours of sleep per day is natural and healthy for most adults between 18 and 64 years of age. And in most studies, and for most experts, sleeping over 9 hours per day is considered an excessive amount of sleep. And they prove that oversleeping can lead to cognitive impairment, depression, it increases pain, it impairs the fertility, it's higher risk of having obesity, heart diseases, stroke, uh, high blood pressure, and it hires all risks of mortality. To conclude, sleep is good, but you have to be careful to not sleep less or more. This is all I have for today. Thank you.